So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound in this video we'll cover this amazing lab so first of all click on start lab and open the cloud console incognito window now if you are completely new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel now here you can see it is getting signed in automatically if it asks for username and password check the lab for it now here you have to just click on I understand and here another pop-up will come where you have to just select I agree and agree and continue. Once it's done, we have to just activate the cloud shell. Okay, we have to just activate the cloud shell. So wait for a few seconds till the page gets loaded fully. Now here basically you can see what are the tasks we have to do. First of all, activate the cloud shell. And here basically you have to click on continue and authorize yourself. Don't worry, we'll cover each and everything step by step. You'll be able to complete the lab within few minutes only. Now click on continue and then just authorize yourself. Just click on authorize. Now basically I will increase the font size because many of the participants are using mobile phone. So let's help them. Now the first thing is that we have to run the clone command. So basically we are just cloning the repository and it will take some time. So wait for it. So basically we are cloning the repository in which we will be working. From here what we need to do, we need to just first of all run this command. Basically it is creating a soft link. Okay. Now after that we will change the directory, we will come to this directory and we will initiate these things. Basically first thing we are exporting the region and setting the file. And then we will running the prepare environment sh file. So it will take some time so you can wait and in case you haven't subscribed the channel yet, do subscribe it and like the video too. it's done we'll move forward to the next step basically it is related to identity platform and first of all let's check the score for the task number one now here basically if you want to view you can preview the app also now we are moving forward to the configuring of identity platform so minimize it and on the search box just type identity platform you can see we have to click on it and here wait for some time first of all the page is loading now here click on identity platform basically enable identity platform now from here click on the provider option okay wait for the api to fully enable first of all and then we'll initiate all the steps so minimize the cloud shell because we don't need the cloud shell anymore because the url is already provided on the lab instructions so basically first thing is that we have to just click on add a provider then from here scroll down and find the email and password and just click on enable okay now here you have to click on add domain so on the right side right authorize domain click on add domain now here make sure there is no http or slash mentioned basically they have mentioned if you see like this you have to remove the field you can see here they have mentioned that you should remove this https and that command okay sorry the slash one okay now then next now step here, is that we have make sure you have seen this now the next step is that you have to click on save okay you have to click on save and cross verify the domain also and then we'll be adding the user so here by mistake i clicked on the users so the first thing is that you'll see like this if you directly click on it so basically you have to click on save as i said earlier so here let me repeat the process it's very simple just come down over here select email password and just come down again and then the domain was already added so we don't have to do anything just save it so basically you have to save it and then add the users always follow the voice instructions also now here basically you can write this email and the password mentioned over here and then just click on add now it will take some time and you can come back here and check the score and if you're not getting the score try again and do like the video and subscribe the channel thank you have a great day ahead